It's more than password, it's password plus. Our guest stars from the Waltons, Judy Norton Taylor, and from Vegas, Greg Morris. And here's the star of Password Plus, Alan Ludden. Hi, Claire. How are you? Mary Ellen. Mary Ellen from the Waltons is here with us. You're, you're dressing against type, I see, huh? I do have clothes other than overalls. <laughs> okay, but you're wonderful on the Waltons, and we have enjoyed you all these years, and we enjoy you in these, and we enjoy you on Vegas, and we Thank enjoy you, you here. We've right. had a good time this we week. We have a ball. Yeah. We're having a good time. I'm glad you're with us. Let's meet our current players. Aaron de Souza, our champion, Elizabeth Cruz. Come in, Elizabeth. Elizabeth, excuse me just a minute. The tradition is that I talk to the champion first. This lady over here has... She has her family here in the audience today, right? Part of it, yeah. All right, you have $7,700. I hope they're doodly and properly impressed. <laughs> Remind us again about yourself, Erin. Okay, um, I just got back from two years in Brazil. I'm married to a Brazilian. We have a baby. And my parents and my brother and my friend and my, my husband are out in the audience. All right, it's good to have you here. Now, we have a new player. We have a new challenger for you, champ, over here. This is Elizabeth Cruz. Hi, Elizabeth. Hi. Tell us about yourself. Well, I'm a native Ohioan, now living in L.A. So is he. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Where, in Ohio? In trouble. Where in Ohio are you from? Elaria, Ohio. Where is Elaria, Ohio? It's 29 miles. Right. <laughs> 29 miles west of Cleveland. I didn't think anybody knew that. Well, I'm from Cleveland. Okay. <laughs> well, what else? You're out here. What's you doing? I'm, I'm an accounts payable auditor. An accounts payable auditor? Yes. It sounds oh. important, but it really isn't. <laughs> <laughs> I like your style. Let's play the game. Greg has the option. First clue in the first puzzle. Pass or play, Greg? Um, play. Go. Network. NBC. Oh, of course! <laughs> You didn't dare say anything else. I'm very chauvinistic on this network. Proud as a peacock. All right. First clue in the puzzle is NBC. What do you think, Elizabeth? You get to guess. Password. Is it password? No. Okay. Greg has the option. Pass or play, Greg. <laughs> Yes. Is that right? Yes. <laughs> That's right. Okay. Uh -huh. Pass. Oh. <laughs> All right, Judy, he gave it to you. Okay. W. X. Right. <laughs> okay, Aaron. Okay. W, X, Y, Z. X is the next clue in the puzzle. N, B, C, X. Ah, is it um, the alphabet? Is it the alphabet? <laughs> no, there are four letters up there, though. Okay, Judy has the option. W is two words. No, W is one. No. Yes, it is. All right. Check I'm going to play. All right. N. O. <laughs> All right. NBC, X, and O. What do you think it is, Aaron? Is it Hollywood Squares? Is it Hollywood Squares? It is! A good game, a good show, a good network, a good commercial. We'll be right back. <laughs> okay, Elizabeth and Aaron are giving the clues. You're going to have the option, Elizabeth. There's the first word in the second clue puzzle. What are you going to do, Elizabeth? Play. Go. Flower. Rose. Aaron. Flower. That's right. That one. Can I repeat my clue? No. <laughs> it's only a half hour show. All right. <laughs> oh, good. Um. Oh. Okay, Elizabeth. I. <laughs> Last 
last clue, one. Aaron. Oh, gee. What are you going to sing this time? <laughs> um, um, May. Daisy. Yes. <laughs> Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer true. You don't know that. You don't know that song in Walton's Mountain. They don't sing Daisy Daisy. All right, you got two, you got two clues in the one clue in the puzzle up there. You get to guess, Judy. First clue is Daisy. Is it the Dukes of Hazard? Is it the Dukes of Hazard? The what of who? The Dukes of Hazard. That's a show on another network. Oh, okay. I can't. I'm not sure which one. I'm not either. I am. Oh yes, it is the same. All right, Aaron. I will. Play. All right. Um. Jolson. Al. <laughs> Liz. Captain. Mammy. Mammy. <laughs> All right. Wait a minute. Now, there we have an instance of an absolute opposite because they're the sexual opposites. You see, you had the mama, the the female, and the male. That is the pure definition of an opposite. So you got it right, illegal clue. She gets to guess. Can Two I see clues the up clue? there Daisy oh. and Mammy. Is it Little Abner? Is it Little Abner? <laughs> yes. Sorry about that, Elizabeth. The next clue was Pappy. And then we have Handsome and Hillbilly. All right. But there was in a case of the real opposite, the Mammy and Pappy opposites. Okay, do you understand that, Elizabeth? Yes. All right, here we go. Now we have a $200 puzzle. Greg has the option. The ladies have 200 on my right. Here we go. Pass or play, Greg? Play. Go. Sculptured. Bust. Second clue. He said sculptor. Sculptured, yeah. Sculptured. sculptured. Yes, is that what you said? Yes. Sculptured, yes. Wood. Carving. Yeah. You'll take it? All right. Carving for card. All right, carved. First clue of the puzzle, Aaron, it's for the game. Carved. Is carved. Oh, was it, uh, uh, I don't know. All right, she doesn't know. Judy has the option. Second clue in the puzzle. Pass or play, Judy. Um... I'm gonna pass. All right, Greg. First clue. Uh, Rushmore. Mount. Second clue. Edge. Um, edge, you said? Edge. Uh, ledge. Third clue, last for you, Greg. Precipice. Pit. Last clue, Judy. Fall. Cliff? Yes. Oh, okay. All right, Aaron. You've got two clues up there, and this is for the game. You have carved and cliff. Is it Mount Rushmore? Is it Mount Rushmore? Yes, you won the game. Are you on card? You got it on card? Okay. The other clues were faces, monument, and president. Presidents at Mount Rushmore. Okay, you're going to play alphabetics again. You have a fine gift, Elizabeth. We thank you very much. It's been very brief but very pleasant. Thank we'll be you right so back. Much. Don't go away. <laughs> Wait, I don't know. Maybe you're not going, Elizabeth. <laughs> got two announcements. First of all, we have discovered by deep and thorough investigation that W is actually a hyphenated, two words hyphenated. The, for the word, for the letter W, you have double U hyphenated. So, that was accepted, could have changed the outcome of the game. So Elizabeth is right over there, and she'll be back to compete with you again. Fine. Now, you see what happens. This lady has $8,100. Aaron, let's win $5,000. Now, we have 10 passwords for you, arranged alphabetically, starting with the letter B. And going alphabetically all the way through to the letter K. You get 10 of them in 60 seconds, you got another $5,000. How'd you like that? Oh, fine. That'd be good, wouldn't it? What's the first letter? Uh, B. B. Okay, there is the first word. Judy, got your clues? Okay, you have 60 seconds. Good luck to you both. Go. Adam. Adam. Adam, I don't know. Explosion. Bomb. C. Whipped. Chains. <laughs> Chopping. <laughs> Chopping. <laughs> Chop. Oh, cream. D. Nurse. Doctor. E. Columbus. 
Dean Pinsa I don't know. Um, Discoverer. Erickson. Uh, Christopher Leif Erickson. Category. E Europe, European. Go on. Go F. Smoke. Fire. G. Billy. Grange. I don't know. Sheep. Billy. G goat. H. Tornado. Hurricane. I. Shot. Hit. I don't know. Go on. Needle. Um, injured. Pass. Go on. K. J. Orange. Juice. K. Henry Kissinger. E. Discoverer. Oh. Explorer. Oh. Explorer. Columbus. Explorer. Yeah. And the needle and the uh, shot was an injection. But you picked up $800, coupled with what you had, gives you, now listen to this, $8,900. That's not bad, is it? That's great. Okay, let's go back and play. Elizabeth's waiting. Here we go. Back to play. This time, Elizabeth's with you, Judy. All right. Judy Norton Taylor and Elizabeth Cruz. Good to see you again, Elizabeth. I thank you. Now you're over here on this side. We'll see what happens. Aren't you glad W was two words? I didn't know that. I didn't either, I didn't really. Either. You have to stop and think about it, actually. It refers to one letter, but it is two words that says it, the W. And this gentleman here was wise enough to spot it. He would be. Yes. All right. If he said it, he would have noticed no, it. Oh, yeah. He, he's a good player, but very honest about the whole thing. You ready to go? Let's start a brand new competition. Judy has the option. There it is. First clue in the first puzzle. Pass or play, Judy? Uh, pass. Okay, Greg? Go. Processions. Parades. Very good. <laughs> Aaron, first one in the puzzle is parades. Um, you guess. What do you think? Is it, uh, um, January 1st? Is it January 1st? <laughs> All right, Greg has the option. Here's the second clue in the puzzle. Pass or play, Greg? Pass. Judy? Beauty. Beast. <laughs> Second clue, Greg. Festivities. Festivities? Uh, Too long. Judy? Um, contest. Floats. Last clue, Greg. Beauty. Beauty festivities. Beauty. <laughs> now you think you have it, Elizabeth? Yes. What is it? Contest. No, it isn't. It's pageants. Oh. Pageants. Oh, yes. Pageants goes up. Nobody guesses. Pageants. All right. Greg has the option again. Here you go. Pass or play, Greg. I'm going to try it. All right. Vincent. Price. Very good. <laughs> All right. Vincent would be thrilled with that. <laughs> Parades, pageants, and price. What do you think? Um, is it uh, the $2.98 beauty show contest? Is it the $1.98 <laughs> beauty <laughs> whatever it is? <laughs> no, it's not. Okay. No comment. Just didn't know the full name. All right, here we go. <laughs> Greg has the option. Pass or play? Play. Okay. Video. Tape. Second clue, Judy. Box. Television. Right. <laughs> All right, Elizabeth. Now you've got four clues up there, and you have a shot at a puzzle. Parades, pageants, price, and television. New Year's uh, Day Parade. Is it the New Year's Day Parade? No? Okay. It looks like he knows it. <laughs> and he does, too. Judy has the option. Uh, 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 pass. Okay, Greg. Um, Ludden. Alan. <laughs> Judy? Presider. Host. Yes. yes. <laughs> All right, Elizabeth. Oh. You got five clues up there. Parades, pageants, price, television, host. I have no idea. Elizabeth, I mean, Judy, you get to help. 
Is it um, Bill Barker? Say it again. Bill Barker? Or oh. Bob? Is it, uh, what is you say? Uh, Bob is Barker, it, Bob Barker. Is it Bob <laughs> Barker? <laughs> <laughs> well, I get called Bill Ludden all the time. All right, oh. Bob Barker. Rose Parade, the Miss USA, the Miss Universe pageants, of course, Price is Right. He is the papa of us all, as far as hosts are concerned. Bob Barker, you've got $100. Takes three to win. We have a commercial. Bob Barker got to be called Bill, too. I get to be Bill all the time. We'll be right back. Don't go away. Bob Barker. Well, I, I don't know. I think people just think all MCs are called Bill. I get called Bill so much that I... You know, I got, can I just inject a personal note for a moment? It's a, it's a good opportunity to say something I've been wanting to say. Bob Barker has never won an Emmy for being a host on a game show. Now, some of us have, but if there ever were a host of a game show who deserves an Emmy, it's Bob Barker. And I want him to get one this year, because he's the best. He does an incredible job at everything he does. All right, let's play the game, shall we? Aaron and Elizabeth have the clues. Aaron has the option. Pass or play? I'll play. Go. Toasty. Tasty. Elizabeth. Crunchy. <laughs> Crumbly? <laughs> I'm getting hungry. Uh, <laughs> third clue. Bacon. Crispy. Yeah, we'll take it for crisp. Bacon, we were all waiting for bacon. <laughs> all right, you've got the first clue in the puzzle. It's crisp. What do you think it is? <laughs> <laughs> you really know how to destroy a career, don't you? I don't know. <laughs> all right, here we go. We got another lot. Four more to go. Here we go. Aaron, pass or play? Uh, pass. Elizabeth. <sighs> Nabisco. Cracker. Liz, er, Aaron. Cereals. Mm, Cornflakes. Elizabeth. Flakes. Wheat. Last clue, Aaron. Company. Kellogg. Yeah. Oh, we were waiting for that, Aaron. All right. Now, how good luck to your career, uh, Greg. <laughs> you got two clues up there, Crisp and Kellogg's. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Snap, crackle, and pop. <laughs> is that your answer? Or are you it's asking? Really, is it snap, crackle, and pop? Oh! <laughs> I thought you were being smart. <laughs> Very good. Rice cereal sound. <laughs> snap, crackle, and pop. Don't you feel a little silly? <laughs> You I've got them before. I know, <laughs> but it, it's the sound of rice cereal. Snap, crackle, and pop indeed. I wonder how Bob Barker would have handled that. All right. Very good. So we have $100 over here. We have $100 over here. we got a $200 puzzle coming up right after this commercial coming up. We'll be right back. <laughs> Oh, sound. It's all sound. Chris Kellogg. Chris Kellogg. It had no sound. Okay. All right, Elizabeth Cruz. You'll be back tomorrow, and we'll see whether you do it. Now, you have $100 over here. You have $100 over here, and we'll be back tomorrow to see whether you keep your championship. <laughs> tell your friends. Will you? Will you do us a favor? The only way we'll stay on the air is for you to tell your friends that you enjoy watching Password. Tell them it's a good game this week, competition tight tomorrow. The Password today is Horse Sense. I know that's two words. It comes from our good friend Ruth Olson in Chicago, Illinois, who says Horse Sense is something horses have that keeps them from betting on people. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Some of our contestants will receive cleanup as quick and easy with this four-piece premium bakeware set from wherever surface with Silverstone, Silverstone's Feld's Durability. Toastmasters System 3 Large Oven Broiler Bakes, Broils, Roast. Slow heat cooks entire meals in separate dishes. Continuous cleaning from Toastmaster. The Peerless Home Water Filter. Clearer, fresher tasting drinking water from your own faucet for as little as six cents a gallon. Blenders, frozen bagels, a honey any time of day taste treat. All natural, no preservatives, pre-sliced, delicious, warmed or toasted. That's bagel 
Magic by Linda's Bagels. Blue Luster Shampoo and Blue Luster Plus Carpet Shampoo. With grease cutters and brightness to remove ground in dirt and grime. And happy eating from the Colonel with finger licking good good ugly fried chicken and an insulated bag to keep things fresh. It's nice to feel so good about a meal. And the member of our studio audience will receive heart fireplace furnishings, including a black and brass heart glass screen, matching antique wood basket and fire set furnished by heart. This is Gene Woods speaking for Password Plus. A Mark Goodson, Bill Todman production.